Lord is king. Sing on to the Lord. New song. Sing on to the Lord. All the earth. Sing a holy song from your heart. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, my yeah. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, wonderful, 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 wonderful is the Lord. Yeah. 
Someone will say that had it not been a cause, there is a cause. Your helper has made you to come into his presence. And if you have come into his presence, there is one thing that you cannot go away without doing. As the songwriter said that you should bow down and worship him. Therefore, with one accord, we are going to bow down and worship the Most High God. And we will invite our dearest sister in the person of Sister Nana Sefa. She will lead us through this session. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah.
Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want to plead with you to be on your feet. If we look at Acts 16, verse 16, Ekasafa, Paul, and Silas. talks about Paul and Silas that has been in prison. Beloved, prison is not a pleasant place. They went through pain, they went through difficulties. They were bruised. But even out of this, they sang to the glory of God. If it was today, we would have said that the Lord has rejected us. What kind of worship do you have before the Lord tonight? Are you waiting for the Lord to do something for you before you begin to worship Him? Even as we sing this song, begin to worship Him.
At this moment, begin to ponder the greatness of our God. I say, who or what shall separate us from the love of God? Now, I say, a dying crowd, now, why pons to the bed to many at the tea and in your coupon at the moon? Persecutions, a bayer or tire, whatever tire, sicknesses, a bayer or yarrow, farming, a bayer or come. I said nothing whatsoever should separate us from the Now I said bibi piara ni wa e sesa etimi atete ya ni nyankopon tam Somebody are drinking your radicacy ya ho Last moment begin to ponder over the greatness of our Lord Psalm 120 Psalm 103, verse 1 to 5. Or say, Praise the Lord, O my soul. All my innermost being, praise his holy name. Praise the Lord, my soul. And forget not all his benefits. Who forgives all your sins and heals all your diseases. Who redeems you from the, from the pit and crowns you with love and compassion. Who satisfies your desires with good things so that your youth is renewed like the eagles? Mm-hmm. Praise the Lord, O your soul. Arafonum, yen sing a midin and bunyam, ayadi a kumen yan, edi ye e ye. Samria, wo drinking ye radicas ye hon, no wo shre radi, wo truntum no wa kumum, no wo yenikesi wo wa kumum. Even as you continue to ponder over the greatness of God, I want you to worship God from your heart and within your heart.
Amen. Amen. We invite PIWC choir to minister unto us a song. Praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. Let we bless God this evening. Amen. Today our song says miracle worker. Hallelujah. Amen. Miracle worker. Miracle worker. Come and do a miracle. A miracle today. Come and do a miracle. A miracle today, say miracle worker, oh, miracle come worker, do a miracle, come and do a miracle, a miracle today, come and do a miracle. A miracle today. Here's a miracle worker. Miracle worker. Here's a miracle worker. Miracle worker. Come and do a miracle. A miracle. 
Come and change a destiny, a destiny today. Come and change a destiny, a destiny today. Say, destiny changes a destiny changer. Destiny changes a destiny changer. Come and change. A destiny, a destiny, a destiny today. Come and change a destiny, a destiny today. We say your name is Yahweh. Tonight we say, come and heal, so powerful, so powerful today. Come and heal, so powerful, so powerful today. Powerful healer, powerful healer, so powerful healer, powerful healer, powerful healer. So powerful today. Come and heal. So powerful. So powerful today. Your name is Yahweh. Yahweh. Then give a better clap offering. Indeed, we serve a miracle worker. We serve a powerful healer. And we serve a way maker. Not only that, we also serve a promise keeper. And it is this promise keeper who has informed you or assured you that remain in him. Because he is with you. Son and sir, or can't Oh, amen. Amen. That you know, two and chance and yamaka and it's a brother or a sister that God is with you. So remain in him. Oh, amen. 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 And son, I be my papa no. Before we give the microphone to Apostle, we have one of our sisters 
a great musician amongst us. We know her, but it's been a while that we've seen her in our midst. But this weekend, she decided to pay a visit to us. And as she is here to visit us, we also want to receive something from her. Amen. Amen. But the grace of God, he came, she came out with an album last year, October. And I know that if you get one of those CDs, it will be a blessing to you. So even we sit down, we give the microphone to our dear Papa. sister. Thank you. Amen. Oh, amen. Get his bag. Ya fumo pa. Obia swachi amo. Ini bisa nyamia domo hoye. Amen. Eradia kanse obe siraye. Obe siraye amayaye sira emsa wante nyoma nasi eradia kanse obe siraye ao obe siraye amayaye sira mese wakano ebebemu o Ebe <laughs> Anachi radia kase obe siraye obe siraye amaye anunsu yesu wa wa fei na wa se uboi obe tini bo sasu Anachi Yesu wa wa fe ana wa wa sa u boy o be tini bo just remain in him Yesu wa wa fe ana wa wa sa ya boy o be tini bo sa su Oh, yo di mafu. Oh, no, no, be di amaye. Oh, yo kamafu. Oh, no, no, be kamaye. Anachi Yesu wa ya fei. Na wa sayempoi. Oh, be di nebo sasu. Anachi. Oh, 
the Lord will fulfill his promise. As you remain with him and he is with you. I can assure you that he will fulfill his promise. Like our apostle will say, if he had said that in Maryland Central, they would have shouted a big amen. And I am saying that because the Lord is with you, he will fulfill his promise. Amen. Amen. Tonight we are privileged to be under the feet of God once again. We began a four day journey. Today is the second day. And I know that you were blessed last night. And it's my prayer that tonight you will be more blessed. Oh, amen. Amen. And tonight, without wasting much time, I would like to invite to the podium our own daddy. Now, Apostle Dr. Amos Jimmy. Yeah, yeah, Papa. Apostle Amos Jimmy Markins. Oh, bon Give that radio. clap offering, that big clap offering. Praise Begin to pray in tongues. Glory, glory, 
Can we take our Bibles together? As we stand in his presence and read the Holy Script together. Tonight, we are reading from Ephesians chapter 1. Verse 7, verse 10, verse 11, and verse 13 for a start. I love to let the people stand to read because I want them concentrated. Amen. Amen. If you are an old lady or an old man, you can sit down. You want the pastor to help you? I'll be okay. You'll be okay. In him, we have redemption through his blood, the forgiveness of sins according to the riches of his grace. Ten. That in the dispensation of the fullness of times, he might gather together in one all things in Christ, both which are in heaven and which are on earth in him. Verse 11, in him also we have obtained an inheritance, being predestined according to the purpose of him who works all things according to the counsel of his will. 13, in him, how many in hims? Have I read tonight? I've already counted four. In him you also trusted after you heard the word of truth, the gospel of salvation, in whom you also, having believed, you were sealed with the Holy Spirit of promise, who is the guarantee of our inheritance until the redemption of the purchased possession to the praise of his glory. And let a church shout and say, Amen. Amen. Let's pray together. Mighty God, everlasting Father, you have granted us an opportunity to be in your midst again. In him, in you, we move. In you, we live. And in you we have our being. Amen. Grant that the entrance of your word tonight Jesus. will bring light. Amen. And that your people will progress from one glory mm. to another glory. Amen. Your name is praised mm. in Jesus' name. This saint shall shout and say, Amen. 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 And amen. 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 And you may be seated. Seated, you can give the Lord a clap if you will. Now, over to me, I'm going to say, I'm to say, I'm going to say, and if you believe that today is a day of your blessings, lift up your right hand. And, and shout, I do. One of the truths I have to tell you is that when God gathers his people like this, it is always the season of determination of somebody's breakthrough. Amen. Come on, shout amen. Amen. Unfortunately, in things like this, in the scripture, in especially in the New Testament. Whenever you find Jesus moving, he doesn't touch two people. Check it. And when he was moved here, he met Bartimaeus, and he met a woman with 12 issues, and he met that one, and he met that one. He never meets two. So this meeting is not for everybody. It's only one person. But guess what? That person is you. If I have said this, and Samekawei Central. Come on, shout Amen. Amen. Yesterday, one rano. 
We began by dealing with the theme for this meeting. The Lord is with you. Remain with him. And I began to provoke you with the fact that the first step to remaining in Christ for him to be with you always begins with an encounter. Mm -hmm. And that is always the first step. The encounter makes you a property of God and makes you belong. You could be sitting here for a long time. Born by a pastor. You do not know him. There is a season when you encounter him when you can look into his face and call him my God. And that is what happened to the Apostle Paul on the way to Damascus. And changed his entire being. And guess what folks? This encounter is Tangible. Yesterday I looked at your time, I looked at your tiredness. I am not able to take it one by one to explain for you what you have become. children. Even as you said that you are not a little person. Hey. What did I say? You are not a child. children. You are not a children. children. You are not something that is little. Hmm. I wish I could. And so yesterday I was just hitting on the toes. Pam pam pam. But Nansu, I will skip. And go a little further. The good news is that the book I brought for you, the proclamation that makes you an overcomer. The second chapter and uh, chapter uh, has a succinct explanation, step by step by step, the how and the processes of how you have become. You still have some, isn't it? If you even didn't go to school, try as much as possible to get one for yourself and for your child. And that is why you took your child to school, isn't it? And so that your child can read this book for you. But as you read it, now, I'm not worried, kind of. Your mind and your, your understanding will be very much enlightened. Uh, what, you know, what we call you are born again. But I say it's a reality. Something about you suddenly changes. Yeah. See, in my house, we used to live with a certain old woman. She never talks with anybody. She has not met anybody. To father, to uncle, to child, everybody. But when I encountered the Lord the first time, I was in that house. One day I was fasting. I'm going to say something. Don't laugh. Don't put it in your mind. I have sacred from that day. I have changed from that day. I was fasting. Now, now they tell me come. And I, 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 I mash my kinky. And I put it inside the fridge. And I'm the fridge in waiting for the fasting to close. So that now, I, I, can't. I have never noticed that this woman has been watching me. Now, now, me, me, and that will explain for you why sometimes you do a lot of things and I can't mind you. I was looking for him. I was praying to him. I was asking him 
to use me no matter what for his purpose. I prayed the whole day. I prayed the whole day. Broken the fasting. Now, we are going to open the fridge. Now, me be a fridge, you man. Ice can't get it for me. The ice can't get where there's nowhere to be found. Ah! Oh, by the time I came out, now I'm not me pee and I'm a buyer. I was more angry than the devil. Now, that me poor fool and poor child up on some as though I've never been to church before. Now, now, yes, I'm in quite sorry, poor man. My little sister had taken it. Now, now, me near back to our before I said, I landed here, bro. Now, me so any more now come here up on a bar. The one we are checking, one just mark down when the basket, yes, can take it. So I gave my sister a blow, amen. But when I held her, now I'm not me so many near by anyone. The old man who never speaks to anybody uh, shouted and said, Hey, Jimmy. As he didn't add any papa, I was a little bit. I said, Jimmy, <laughs> as for you, now, I said, what do you, you are not like that. You want to, sir. And that statement humbled me to I didn't notice that that woman had been watching me closely. Any man or woman who truly encounters Jesus leaves a mark. That mark is clear to see. That mark is tangible, clear to see. I see. had to go back and restart the fasting again. So so I I but that statement, it looks to me that everything I had done was useless. It was the point of time in my life when God wanted to touch something here. Too many times in life, people in relationships are looking for their husbands or their wives to change. But it is not your wife who has to change. It is you who have to change. Abribia, you, have change. you cannot change your husband. And that is why it is very important that you encounter the king. That alone is able to transform and change people's lives and make it what he desires of them. Amen. I pray, I pray, our four, our real no better manager, just a bassassa, Nikur and Yere, or Banos, or Yasa, or Bassassa, Nikur, Nemono, and Yasa, and Sasano, wouldn't a sister would to Miss Sasa. Now, wouldn't a Sabari may and Yasa and Shem, we are married, come once and we are, Sansa, and I bet to me about so. Are you listening to what I'm saying? What's here in America? I remember when that woman asked me in the UK, What did you do to my daughter? Now, Mekai, maybe I'm a maybe a catcher. I'm saying, What then are we? I want me by home. You do to my daughter. Maybe I don't. Why you know? Amen. Amen. I said, Mommy, what has happened to your daughter? I said, She's not the same lady in my house. Now, Papa, so besides, I don't know what done. I quite know. I'm a baby. What's the son on this? I said, You know, this one has never fetched a water for me to drink. Me buy on sun, so I'm poor. Mammy, some men, no matter this one has never answered me back softly before. Me buy me beside a summer. Oh, you man, no book order. I said, Didn't look at her. No, I'm gonna preoccupy me. She's here. When I call her, she says, Yes, Mama. The friend of said, Where did mama. Yes, Mama come from? Now, I feel like the something in the inside is working. On the outside. The the Jesus has been birthed in her heart is working on the outside of her and coming out of her for everybody to see that she's not just a church goer, but she has encountered the Lord Jesus that is able to change and transform. Now, yes, we are. Ask me to stop preaching. Catch them, say me nay. Someone can't tell us, oh, nay, I'm here, someone can. A lot of us think that we have been looking for God. You are a liar. You move everywhere, and say, and you're saying, I mean, a drop. It is He who has been looking for you. Or no mom, no orange show. And He's been looking for us for a long time. What's the show? If you're a baby. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Some of us, we are so, so, so of ourselves. Sometimes when life becomes so, uh, so pleasant for us, it becomes sometimes easy also for us. And when we say it, we become upset. 
somebody will come, he intends to marry you, and he will go eventually. What do you, what do you, say, you think yeah, it's the yeah. devil? It's not the devil. It is not the devil. It is not the devil. When I normally get here, everybody wants to tell me his story as if everything is as a result of the devil. And one day, the devil, when he sees you, will say that, no, 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 this one is not me. It's, it's, uh, some of the things, it's difficult for me to believe. Oh. So, if you have had an encounter with Christ, if you have had an encounter with Christ, if you had an encounter with him, you'll be shy. If he, from the first encounter, there are subsequent encounters in your life as a child of God. Each time you are progressing, at every stop, you encounter him in a strange way. And you are moved to another level. And you are moved to another level. I can tell you things that will make your head stand. In church, one of the processes that is difficult is when you are being transferred. And I used to be in a place called PIWC. I was the first PIWC pastor or the longest serving PIWC pastor in this church. Those times PIWCs were not common, were only two. All my elders were lecturers. People who have bent and, and, and coined their intellect extensively, some of them world class scientists. All of them are sitting on a platform. My choir is about 120 large. And I'm the one that trains them. So when you come to church, you find my two notes. Yeah. You can ask us of mommy. I wear three of my suits. True. Say, become her, become her. Now me just perform no swa. Me two no in the hall. And when I'm on on the platform with this suit, my two no is everywhere. You didn't say a big amen. And 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 and, and the graces I had. I had the whole city to my command. When it is January, every church around us is in trouble. All the people are packed in our place. In the morning, we could count about 2,000 people at a time. You understand what I'm talking about? I've been chopping on stuff like this for seven years, built my temple and did everything. Some people even associated me with that church, thinking that the church belonged to me. Uh, and so people assume that I have made a church as if the church belongs to me. And then I was suddenly transferred. transferred. <laughs> So, if you are transferring me from a PIWC, if you are transferring a pastor from PIWC, the idea is probably you transfer him to a big city or another PIWC. The people lifted me from Tumasi all the way, bam, 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 to Isamankasi North. They want to head it. Now, I shall be a year for PIWC, Kumasi Chrome. Nothing works. The mission house um, I had to live inside was hired from somebody. The owner's son is a drunkard. He will go and drink intentionally and come and insult me for nothing. Now, mission house, I now saw for no mitimo no. I have baby, I am a kohaya di ama ya na papa no. If you are a bano, or you be on no monsa, or kono moba, I saw for obe chama da papa. Now, the place was leaking. I have to borrow my wife's uh, uh, empty cans and put them there. And when it is raining, it will become cold. 
Missy House, who are not a whole you know, and so Tom, you know, Bokiti, and I'm a quadrant of the Akosis Babia, and you know, now about the sense you're not so good. From the road to our house, you meet six pit latrines. Now I say, so for if he a crown or a quantity of fear, no ballers is your best, and the church was so broke. Now I saw no sooner, he can name. They have no money. The only money they have on top of the of the of the divider was two hundred and fifty Ghana cities. Now Sika wa wahono and then obaka ebi anenu ebi at two hundred twenty dollars in book. But you will read my book beginning from where God began and your mind will blow apart. Now sa waka me humana babi nyango pon esasi efisa oye jumano wajeni abaya umama. I found in the, uh, that day they were they were welcoming us. And then I know why my yakwa ba wasoro hono. The people who own the instrument were standing there waiting for us to finish so that they can carry their instrument. And Profana and Chinese ah, instruments here. What is the proper sophisticated instrument with choir? Look at me. I go to church and when they are playing, the women are using a kind of uh, this thing, uh, very powerful one. It is shiny with some ring, ring, ring around it. And the drums were that for that time. A Jano wo to me. But I get gone confused. So I was coming from a place that I have all my instruments intact. My choir was powerful. There comes a place that I have been transferred to that the church on the day of my welcome, the people were waiting to take away their I, instruments away. Yes, Pastor, I can tell you things that will blow your mind. So for me to me, I can say much The first Sunday of familiarization, the first assembly we had to go, I was in three piece p three piece suit. Now assembly di kanya na sa sa ya kwa srawom da edi kano kote na shamano na asia di abu basu miyansa. With a private car with another boat full with the people have come with and we were going, we we're just going and going. I said, what is the church? They said, Pastor, we are going. Now me, my family car, and I'm comforting car. We be sad, sorry, we. I'm the pastor. We name Afeku. When we land, I said, what is the church? I said, you have to pass through the bush. I looked at my jacket and see the bush. Now you do what I say. I saw you. I see a woman running. Mo, so for as I saw we see now, friend, we're in Monaco. Now my friend, we go to a shame. We walked about half a kilometer, and here was some shed with some sticks sitting there, and some palm fronts, and sixteen people sitting on that. I said, "Where is the church?" He said, "This is church." Now I feel you're not here. I call you. I call you. I feel. But I'm in the abba and pembrobi ne si se mui. I'm a better big guso. Now because I saw you, I said, "Papa, what saw you?" Ne si wa. When I came back home. Now, for me, Beth, you know, I didn't wear a three-piece suit again. Now, I called 28 young men. And I said, if there is God who speaks, let us pray to him to speak to us. This is the place James McKeon started. And here we find ourselves so broken, nothing worked. We had prayed until about the 22nd day. And all of a sudden, the Lord says, Move out, all of you. We have gone to the other corners of the city. I have not started my sermon for today. And everything I've said is introduction. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And pastor, as we were mounting up the hill, the earth in front of us spoke. Boom! And there was smoke everywhere. And the young men began to run away. And then I get, I got so them scared. Well, so I told them that if you run away, the devil has already gotten you. So we moved up. As soon as we climbed up, one of the young men began to prophesy. It's amazing. Then he said, here in this place shall be called the valley of the Lord. And like it is of old, the fire of the Lord will come back. And people will gather from all places around the world. Come and seek the Lord in this place. When we came back, 
the next morning Anopano, I went to sit in the place and I marked the place and something drastic happened to me when I sat I was just sitting like she is sitting today when I see some of them sing like this I ask myself a lot of questions where is the spirit of Kananiah and Asaph and that old deeper that call it deep that bring new songs all the time to the people people are just singing any kinds of songs some of them we don't even understand because they haven't met him in their songs on you the spirit of God shall rest upon you. That the spirit of Annas and Kananiah shall take you over. And you will not just sing. You see, sure. you take it from him. As I sat, Somebody came to sit beside me. And he touched me. Now me. And something came to sit beside me sitting here like this. And he asked me. Now who is this one? I looked at him. But he looked like me. He looked like me. But there is all kinds of sport in his heart. Then he says, I said, This place that you have come, you, you are so painful. You don't like it. And you think that person did this against you. Now, that person did that against you. Now, mommy, we say, wait Because I am too quiet. If you even do anything, I won't say anything. So we am bibi, I mean come here. But I have hidden what you have done to me I'm in my heart. And I was using this, and I was be, I was also a pastor at the same time. Look at how you are looking at me. I am talking about my own story, not you. Well, no, and he took this one, and he took this one, and he took this one. So the man then, began to plug all these parts from my he body. Put this one inside this. And put it inside the other person. And, and he left. And I fell, my friend. From that day on. Strange things began to happen. And if I should tell you, the church that didn't have anything, things began to change like this. So, by the time I've, I've heard, they announced on the radio that the fire of James McKeown had fallen again in the Samangas. Sometimes I'll just be sitting. And I'll be talking to myself. Now make kasa chira me hong. Fufu nyena. Fufu nyena ekurasi. Fufu is plenty in the village. You have brought me to this village. I am grand now. What are you trying to tell? My telephone will just call. Na fe ina me telephone and ring it. Vision will be there. Ube huna ni ame shushani ya diaba. It's such a long story. Now where you and Sama and Wapa? I remember one day. Me kaida kurubi. We had to build a tent in that place. Now as I see a sibiribi, I was happy. I want to take all my money. Ma ko yeyi misika mi wonyi na. We have got greed that greeded the thing. Ya toka tapila. Ah, we ju wonyi na di amaya. The money is finished. Afe misika i asan. Amen. How are we going to build a shack? The best thing that the best thing is yes. Hello. Hi. Then a young man had come. He said, my mother has a uh, timber in his, in his farm. Then we go and cut the timber. We need a sawmiller to come and cut. We go to Brekumansu and go and see a sawmiller and say, Master, will you come tomorrow morning and cut the timber for us? He start crying. Why? 
said two weeks ago. Somebody came here. I remember the time he came to sit beside me. The same time, the same hour. The same time. He said when he came, he said he has a work for me to do in two weeks. He paid for it gave me money to go and repair the machine. I've been waiting for him till now. He said you'll be here by 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock here you are. Please. Take me to the place to go and do the work. Papa, go and do the Amen. I came back. The thing is finished. Now me buy a fanny a real baby. Making long story short. Now me come as some swino. I was just sitting in my house. Now now me tell me fear that could be. I got quaps from my old church. Me free quaps from my old church. Me free go for every me am sorry. Can I say quaps? We are so broke. Now me free and I can't say yes. Can you ask her? But we need instruments. Now mom, you hear me? So what can you do to help us? Then I bet to me I had the aboy. He came. Oh, bye. Look at the terrain. Oh, yeah, I went back to Kumasi and gathered all the instrumentalists who were my friend and told them, don't take any instrument to him. The guy is so broke. The place where he is, there's no possibility they can pay. Now, I can tell you, 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 I can tell you. He sent me a telephone and said, I've told the people you are broke, you can't pay, please. Forget about it, just use your tutu. Now, a friend who has a trophy, I can tell you, 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 I can tell you. I sat and began to cry. Now, I can tell you, I can tell you, I can tell you. Very early in the morning. No baby, I am no papa. Five thirty in the morning. Baya no num anefa. As soon as I get up from my hall, we mra mi fi mi fi esa mi piano. I was sitting in front of the house, a four by four. Na me ti mi fi anim na ka a swi bi pa. Covered with the tarpaulin. Ah, ya di niama ejrahu. And the driver was asleep. Na na driver no wada. So I tapped him. Eti bi ne misa bono. And this is Kudadisen. I said, what are you doing here? He said, Pastor, don't ask me questions. I said, Pastor, I have not slept the whole night. That is why I'm here. And I have a pack full of instruments for all you need in this place. Take it. I said, how much is it? I said, the man who helped me when the little girl knocked the car and the car got in and his bones didn't crack reminded me that I have to bring you this. And you have to use it. Don't ask me for cost. I said, what are you so we are just going under the tent and we're playing and doing all the things we have to do. I was looking for money. Everybody say money. Money. Look at the way they look at me. I said they don't like money. After this meeting, the Lord will definitely bless you. I hope you don't go today. Amen. 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 Master. Sofo. I went to my tent. The tent is half full. Me ko bi aya ya bossa patay oho e ho ni na po aya mewe. I see people sitting there, Muslims with their attack. I said quietly, like a broke man, I said in my head, do I start opening prayer or start with collection first? Now, I said, I said, I I said, 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 I I said, 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 I I so we preached. Took another offering. And they sang J for a buffalo for you. No one has to do one. And when we closed and I was sitting on the platform. And the boy and I'm at the platform no so. He brought me a little boy. Oma di abo fraki tuwe bi brami. And said, they said this tent here is dwindling too much that I was pulling up. Slava, I said, pattern wet one. I could change the phone and do a do a. So somebody said or has been been told that this tent that is sitting here is able to cure big, big, big protruding stomachs. Not knowing what had happened was that a young man who has gone to take somebody's wife and is cursed and his belly has protruded and has gone to hospital, they checked his liver and everything and has no cure. Saw us praying and decided to help us do the work we are doing. He went to pick a block. 
to come and put it beside the thing. And when he put it down, his woman reduced the, if the normal size. He didn't come to church. He drove straight to Zongo to tell them that the people stand in t- on the top of the mountain is dwindling so much. Hallelujah! 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 And, 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 and that's it. I feel you know, no, no. That's it. So I gave this small boy to the elder and said, well, your friend, brother, and he said, elder, so now one part, man. So the elder was trying to pray for the boy when the boy's stomach to vanish. Amen. Let me see, I know your phone's what I do, I didn't see the bomb, I had a chick, no bomb, I am, no, 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 then the church started getting food. They were charming. The, 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 the bar, the Methodist. They were mounting this wall and they were coming. Mm. And strange things were happening. Sometimes the thoughts keep coming into my mind and here is he. He will say, I am here. I was amazed. Mm. I was amazed. I was amazed. Just a recap. Mm-hmm. Every place you will be, you need a kind of encounter, even your fresh marriage, when you have your first child, a new, work, a new relationship. As you pray, God opens another avenue. And another if I should tell you about what made me evangelism, that yesterday you said the national evangelism. We don't have that title in our church. Sir, we have the evangelism director, and then we have the national evangelism leaders in the nations. <laughs> so, uh, it is because of a strange encounter at Bolgatanga. You know, I was also for at Bolgatanga. It was an encounter. He showed me to move all my pastors. I had 22, 28 pastors. And take them from the place. And take them into the places where you show me. So I moved them there. I showed them how to evangelize. And I leave it for them. I remember one pastor. We went to Garu. And we went to Garu. And he was standing there that night. Oh, preach, yeah. He preached and preached and preached. Then a man whose hand was not that straight he began to be straightened. The following day, he was a prophet. Amen. Hey, he came to my house like this. I said, What must you say? Oh, he must hear him. I said, What happened to you? Then I asked him, He has identified God on him. Shout amen. Amen. And so when we come like this, and you sit like this, you don't look at us as though we are the ones who are carrying something to bring you. No, the thing is with him. Everybody say him. Him. I'm talking about Jesus. He's the one that needs to be encountered. He's the one whose garment we have to hold. See, in him we live. In him we move. In him we have our being. There's somebody we have to pay for to look for, pay for to look for, pay for to look for. First to look for. It is not the preacher. It's him. He is the determining factor. Shout amen. Amen. He is your Lord. And your master. Come on, shout amen. 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 Too many people are failing in this life because they have forgotten about him. But says, if you look for him, you will find him because he's not too far away. He's closer to you. Amen. Amen. And I 
see them all the time carrying their bags, going from this prayer camp and to that prayer camp and following that man of God and that man of God and following. And you have been following closely for 20 years, two decades. You are still following. The direction is wrong. Who you have to look for is where are you, oh Jesus? Can I tell you something? Amen. Amen. Can I? Amen. Amen. Can I tell you something? Many of you go back somewhere and carry things and bring them here. You go to collect all kinds of strange oil green. But I will show, show you how. Match them on. Say, uh, 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 breakthrough oil. The other one, what is his name? Uh, uh, something oil. And all kinds of things. You went bringing so, this and put them so, on your forehead and carry about in this forehead and look at you. Amen. 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 I wish I would have the opportunity to explain. When you meet him, you change. His, when his finger touches you, something about you changes. And you have the liberty to stand and say that not my, the people's God, but my God. I, 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 I know him for myself. Oh, I'm still preaching. Yes. Shout amen. Amen. And when you are in, it's, it's time for trouble, you don't go and crack your saying, Where is my prophet? Where is Jimmy Markin? That's it. Oh, how be that? Da, da, da. <laughs> so, how be that? What to me can go post of four points of four way? Apostle, one by one, Mada. That is the difference. Way and the answer to you. Between us and Nakaba people. Ah, and I am Tamnis and Crofono. Are you listening to what I'm saying? What is the American? Amen. Shout amen. Amen. It's subsequent after the first one, the, 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 it comes like that. Anytime you are inadequate and you feel empty and you feel unable, you go to him and you cry to him, Oh God, please can you help me? I need you. Oh, open an avenue of hell for me. And he does all the time. You know, this Jesus is not like your enemy. He's not even like your wicked uncle. He doesn't consult your enemies to bless you. Even in weakness, his power is still strong. Even in temptation, his mercy still overflows. His goodness and mercies are over all his people. The starting point for his children is his goodness and kindness. David said, come and taste and see that the Lord is very bad. Now, David said, Come and taste and see that the Lord is half good. What did David say? Now, then, David the kind that the Lord is what? He 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 is is his goodness. It is his goodness. So if you encounter the Lord and he has not done anything for you at all, I know that he has been good to you. At least you are better than your enemies. Shout amen. 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 Uh, my Bible. Can I still preach? Thank you. But I will lift a little bit ahead of this because all this I said in the last time. Okay. So right, right here as you sit, you begin to long for him. Oh, oh God, I want to know you. 
I want to meet you. Eh? I want to encounter you. I want to see you. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. But when you come to him like that, there is something that he does to you in him. Amen. 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 And those are the things I want to understand. What you have become in him. What you have become in him. Say it with me. What you have become in him. So make it personal for yourself. What I have become in him. That's the first question you ask. So since I came to him, what have I become in him? And the first one I want us to look at is Ephesians chapter 1, verse 7. And open your Bible. Good. Ephesians chapter 1, verse 7. Now I'm reading. Yes, go on. It's already on the board. So let us read it together. Go on. In him we have redemption through his blood. The forgiveness of sins according to the riches of his grace. So according to the riches of his grace, what have we become or have in him? Redemption. So the first thing we have in him is what? It's what? Redemption. Redemption. What does it mean to be redeemed? To be redeemed is to be bought back. You used to be under the power of the devil. Under the effect of his power. But once you have encounter in, with him, you have been redeemed in him. Look into my eyes. And so, many, so many people tell us a lot of stories. And some of the story they tell us is that once we are Africans, we are under the bondage of the devil. How many of you have heard that before? And sometimes they inspire the fact that we need some very, very special healing. But the Bible says it clearly. Once you find yourself in him, you have redemption in him. If, if, if you look at the state of our affairs, it looks so positive and true. When I used to be in college, I went to school at St. Augustine's College in Cape Coast. Now, me high school, I'm a Your friend is St. Augustine's. And I used to visit the Cape Coast Hospital. Now, I'm a Cape Coast. I are Sabia. There was a doctor in the place, a lady called Lady Fiosi. Now, you were a doctor, you were a doctor. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm a friend. Shout Amen. Amen. I'm for us. I'm not going to die. I'm not going to uh, so she was reading the scripture hey. back there and she is very, very, very good. God bless you. And you are taking me nice, nice pictures. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> Hallelujah. What was I saying? Can somebody remind me? Say, ask me on there. Yeah, <laughs> Praise God. Hallelujah. So, the lady is, has, a, has a mental problem. So, sometimes when people are in her consultancy, she will just go wild and then she will begin to do some things. But one day in my grandmother's house, 
A lady teacher from second D came to live in our house. Ideally, our building, our barstool didn't have a uh, 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 story, didn't have a barrister in front. In fact, the building was still in, co in, in construction. Where it was just being built that time. Now and when the teacher came, my grandmother gave her the top place to sleep. And then she said she's her friend's child. One morning, as we got up from there, we got up from bed. The lady had threw her little boy's son from the building. Thrown all the things she brought from the top. And he took strong men, fishermen, to bundle her. Otherwise, she would have thrown herself and killed herself. And nobody knew where to take her except my grandmother. So she led the train and they took her to her hometown. When they go to the place, they met two of his brothers. One was a locomotive engineer trained in India. And one was also a botanist from trained from Germany. Botanist? Yes. And all of them were mad. In their home. So my grandmother asked her friend. And then she said, One of them is the doctor nurse at the hospital. And everybody who comes here and belongs to this family, as soon as his feet touches here, he goes mad. Then my grandmother asked her, What was the story? She says somebody traveled from beyond Burkina Faso. To come and buy salt. And he was, he was a chief. So the grandfather of those people who was the chief killed him. Buried his body in the house. And used his head and his blood. Amazingly. The people were able to trace all the way from up north and come straight to the house and said, we have traced to find out that our chief died in this house. He was buried in this house. It is okay, we don't want any trouble, but our corpse cannot lie anywhere. Just give us the remains. Let Settled. The man said no. We didn't see him. And so they spoke a word. Said, as long as the earth remains, if indeed his body remained here, every person belonging to this throne and from your seed who steps in this place will go mad. And it has continued up to that time. I have only given you a picture. So just to you what it means by redemption. Many or all of us had come from backgrounds worse than this. Destined for death. 
implicated as suspects. And our destinies, our destinies have been tainted. And we have been reserved for struggling. And there is no hope for us. But the truth is this. No matter how awful your story looks like, as soon as you come into Christ, through the blood of Jesus, your, 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 your privilege of being in Him, God brings you a redemption. Oh, I'm preaching to God's people. Amen. And drive it on your mind. That you are no longer on the bondage. But in him, you have redemption. In him, in him, I have redemption. I have redemption. People would have given him a crown. Amen. Yes, you are redeemed. No question, so what you? But guess what? No fish. Before there is a redemption, answer no. You don't have to feel like you are redeemed. Man, you say, I am a say, Yachimi. No, you don't even have to feel it. And that's how one would think, Cassie, at you. The Bible says you are. Bible on the sound of Sani, I own. Amen. Amen. It's not a matter of feeling. Whether you feel it or you don't feel it. And yes, I will think I see a Jimmy and I know what thing go, what thing go, Yajum. That is how it is. But the quim, pretty. It is straight, simple as that. But the quim. It is in its place. Look into my eyes. Shamanim. It doesn't matter the village you came from. And finally, a crown of sea, I will feel by. Everybody here comes from a village. Shout amen. Amen. But it doesn't matter that village you came from. See, it's Yesterday, there was a chat. I was, I was smiling at the back of my mind. And Rana and Commodia because you will be feeling an amiss room with you. As if I have no head. And I am my host and I maintain a whole kind of they call it paragliding or something. Obviously, be by a friend paragliding. paragliding. The one you sit in. Oh, what's your man? I do TV. One of the men said, Hey, let me go to the Mifia. Let me go to the room. So one of them actually made a statement that. From where I am coming from, my house, I cannot go and sit in that. I will definitely come down when I sit in that. The witches in my house. Obiara, nobody can chew you tea. Obiara, and to me, Angel. Amen. If you are in Him, you have redemption. In Him. We have redemption. Yeah, well, and that is why we have to remain in him. And no thing as I see to me turning. Am I preaching to people? Mary Cassatra will be what her do is this. Yeah, to me and the basis of our redemption is that and our grandfather Yen Nananum killed the man. Omuku Saba buried the man. Was Yenu. And so there is something against us. But our Lord Jesus Christ came to replace that man. Allowed himself to be killed. Allowed himself to be sacrificed. And that is tit at it. He has prayed for the man that was killed and buried. Come on, shout amen. amen. By his blood. He has paid a ransom. Amen. 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 So every sin you ever committed in this life, your grandfather ever committed, your great grandfather ever committed, or you have ever committed up to this way, I came to tell you you are forgiven. In him. 
When you move, you have forgiveness of sin. No, no, who upon the first they looked at me and said, So, how does God see me? I said, I even see you so spotless. He said, Apostle, you are not a prophet, you are not seeing well. You are not a, 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 a prophet that I, I should trust. Me, she has come to live in uh, Virginia or something. She had a baby now. She was a full and she didn't go to school. Now, I said, I mean, not officer of Ghana. I said, oh, America, ha. I'm sorry, to Virginia, her baby. She was a full, full and a very beautiful young woman, and she, 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 she was doing a certain work. I say, na mami, na huwa fepa na na oye ju mebi ameri ju mi kasi. Oye ni ame fa sukra ni beti na. I saw them one what? So unko be biada after a convention on Timbrofu. So the way you go into, yes, so you see and catch you. Oh hallelujah! So the way God brought this woman in, she said she wouldn't go back again. And the way this woman actually was looking, and if you look at her, you know into. We couldn't do anything to her. No. I, I looked at her as if she looked so spotless. I showed her, so 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 I I I was coming from uh, a man. You see, and that was the day she accepted the Lord. And I saw that on Sunday, fair rather said the crown and a chain guard day on. Now, if you saw that at the corner, maybe I have to quote it. It be as I said, me being a mechanic, Ramo. Let me wear my glass. So, oh, glory to God. Where are you? Bible. Bible. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everybody open your Bible to First Corinthians chapter six. And bring it here on the board for us. Verse number nine. First Corinthians chapter six. Verse nine to eleven. Verse nine to eleven. Good one. Where is he? He's struggling. Yeah, coming. Everybody, let us read it together. Go. Do you not know that the unrighteous will not inherit the kingdom of God? Powerful statement. Do Go. not be deceived. Neither fornicators, nor adulterers, nor adulterers, nor homosexuals. When I'm dry. There be. When I'm dry. Did I wrote this? Go on. Nor sodomites. Can you please? Nor thieves. No, covetous. 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 That's the word. Covet. Covet. And uh, And and guess envious what? Envious people. This is the most powerful scene in all the Bible. Where any idea about what and who power to run? Covetous. Oma, oma, yeah, any brief. It's coveting that makes every person pay for everything he wants. Eh, uh, you see, I do baby cry, but I know be a better answer. I pay for. No, no, no. It's it's it's, it's just witchcraft. Oh, you just say you can't say oh yeah, pay for. Yeah, guess how we 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 or by phobia and to her. Bring that in, let us read it. Master, I'm going to find you up your mommy. When, when you are tired, tell me also, because I can talk like this until they break. Sir, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you. It's thieves and what? No what? No drunkards. No revealers. No extortionists will, will inherit, inherit the kingdom of God. Did I write that? No. Some of you, when it is time for funeral, forget about Jesus. Look into my eyes. You know the problem we have plenty. Sometimes I feel so sad. Some of you struggle to come and live in this place. You live in close relation. Close relation. And after you have built a house in Ghana. Now, 
your life begins to break apart because of that building. But you are living here, you will not even go and stay in that house. Even if you go and live there for one month, they will, you'll be given only one room. And you allow just that one building to break your life apart. What the world uses it for? What the world uses it for? We we are for that one day. So many people are telling you all kinds of stories. So bet me a book a can mambo. And see, as a young lady like this, you go to funeral on Saturday, and then you go and do thing and you come, and you say nobody saw me. You move every hour and some people in your catcher and so no man a mambo. And see, you quiet here and my bar one rant here. Now you come check a can. Now you ban your bed transiting. Gradually driving away from your life. Kakran kakran kakran. Who feel a bravo? You said that for this place is America. But the Bible says it clearly. The drunkards will not inherit the kingdom. Drunkards will not inherit the kingdom of God. And I did not write that. Uh-huh. So let us read together. No, no, no. Bring the tenth one. Okay. Then we'll come back to the eleven. Everybody go. No thieves. No covetous. No drunkards. No revelers. No extortioners will inherit the kingdom of God. Go to eleven. And such were some of you. But you were washed. Hallelujah. But you were sanctified. Hallelujah. But you were justified in the name of the Lord Jesus and by the Spirit of God. Give yourself a clap of it. You are no longer what you are. Lift up your two hands and say, I'm washed. Lift up your hands and say, I'm washed. I'm washed. Do you need another water to wash you? So if I come quickly with my robe and I said, go and buy support and buy water. And let me go and bath you. Will you agree? So many people are being bathed in the hotel. They are being in the hotel. Amen. But you are washed. But you are cleansed. But you are sanctified. Come on, shout amen. Amen. In him, you are sanctified. You are spotless and clean. It doesn't matter your past. In him, you are washed. And all your sins are forgiven. What it says is that in him, you have been sanctified. It means you have been made holy. You have been sanctified. You have been made as if you were without sin. There is no record of evil hanging upon your neck in him. It it you have been justified. The justification means it looks like as though you have never ever sinned before. So, I may have broken my virginity in the past. In him, I am still a virgin. Amen. Walk like that and talk like that. But and I think like that. Now, I am now, justified now. by faith. Come on, shout amen. amen. Not because I didn't do it. And yes, I'm a no. But because I found myself in him. You see? Amen. And that is the reason why Pastor is asking us to remain. As, 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 as long as I remain in him, I have continual cleansing by the blood. The Bible says the blood of Jesus continually cleanses me of all my sins. Can I tell you something? Jesus said, even the words you have heard tonight and some are in poverty and are doing what is all right. Right. Oh, what? Da, da. oh hallelujah i feel like preaching this and this is the point where all our problems begin as soon as i begin to pray in the morning and i kneel down beside my bed 
Oh, Father in heaven. Oh, a radio was wrong. A clear voice speaks to my ears. Now, a near, a near, at the bar, I can say, Jack, He says, my, my, my son, oh, keep quiet. Who is your father in heaven? Why no Papa was wrong? Or the one you like you. A sinner like you. So you quickly change your prayer. It's your favor, so I won't buy one of the son. Almighty gracious father. Oh, a radio, we have the son of Adam. May I Adam I see me? I am the son of Adam. May I Adam ba? I am I am You see? I am full of sin. Oh God, help me. Oh, I rather You you'll be sitting on that way until you get to a point where you cannot pray anymore. And you get up. I feel sorry. And the devil say I got him. That is his modus operandi. When you show work he does in your life. When your son is sick. And you have to pray for the son. As soon as you lifted up your son. He says, how can God hear you? A sinner like you. Even yesterday. You told a little lie. And your abem begin to break. Then I fear you begin to lose hope. Your hope is gone. Then you stop there. Oh, then let me go and call the presiding elder. <laughs> because his prayer is the longest one that can reach heaven. But it does not depend upon your righteousness. Our righteousness is what we found in him. In him, we have the righteousness of God. We have the forgiveness of sin in him. And then I will enjoy. You understand? In him, shout amen. Amen. Shout amen. Amen. I don't know what to do tonight. Probably I need to continue. Tomorrow. So that you can have enough. Because of the time. But I want you to understand clearly all the things that you have had in him. And uh, I will blow your mind apart tomorrow. Amen. Something explosive in the word of God. It, it, it will lift you to another level. Amen. Some of you don't know that you are the ones who is going to show even the devil the wisdom of God. Amen. Amen. Sometimes when you get before God and you need things from him you need to understand. The verse, verse we read seven, eh? Let's read verse 10. It says that in the dispensation of the fullness of times, we are reading from Ephesians, he might gather together in one all things. He might gather in one all things. In Christ, both which are in heaven and which are on earth. And in him, when you see, note it there. And on the line it. In him, all things find their fullness and completion in him. in him. And so if there's something you have to desire, what is it? To remain. That's to remain. That's it. All things find their fulfillment and completion in him. In him, the fullness of God is made complete both in heaven and on earth. And look at verse number 13. Open your Bibles carefully and see this. And it says, in him, and so underline it again. In him, when you move, also trusted. Najidi, after you heard the word of the truth, the gospel of your salvation, in whom also, when you after having believed, 
You were sealed with the Holy Spirit. And that is the point I'm going to be talking about tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Oh, amen. Speaking, let me hear. To speak and say, Abba, Father. A welling up of his self out of us. See? Number 14 says, Who is the guarantee of our inheritance until the redemption? Of the, pos- of the purchased possession to the praise of his glory. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. I will give you some free scriptures when you go back home. Read it. Read it before you come tomorrow. Ephesians 2 verse 1 verse 13 chapter 13 Ephesians 2 verse 1 and verse 13. Ephesians 2 verse 1 and verse 13. And read Ephesians 3 verse 10. Now King Kai, Ephesians 2 verse 1 and verse 13. Shout Amen. Amen. The purpose is that He might cause you to rest from all your heavy labor. That in him, that he might, that you might be redeemed to demonstrate the authority of God. That you may be freed for freedom. That you having been set free by him. Will have the opportunity to set other people free. Oh, come on here. Amen. Let's have your right hand. And for that matter, in him, you have become a priest and a king. Do you understand that factor now? What the way I say? You read it. Okay. And you understood it now. Now what the way I say? Become a priest. What by a osophon? And become a king. Now what's that by a ohene? Look into my eyes. Shemenim. You are so powerful. You don't know. When you were too me power, we nim. As Anya, you remove the apostle and put it down. When we are mitchira hand, we the man from apostle fatu baby. And put all the doctor and his brothers aside. Now doctor and so I come with him. So fatu baby. I look the same like you. Amen. Except when I am preaching, I come here and make my tuno. When I'm in the house, you ask them. I am on the floor like every one of them. Some of them, my little girl, my own daughter, she looked at me uh, after we have come from church. She looked at me and said, Are you sure you are the same person who was on the platform? Also, Apostle says, So, Oba, sorry, I'm not pam, pam, pam. I'm not going to preach. Just change. So she will look at me and she will go and sit down here and look at me again. Especially when she begins to hear strange stories. Our farm at Wasade. baby Wasa Ghana Western region. baby. In this farm, there was an idol worshiper who used to live there. No, no, no. Oh, there, there was an idol that lives there. A magician. So I was the one who went there. And he went, I mean, he went away. I drove him away in the day. I'm teaching him. Oh, hallelujah. I'm teaching him. 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 I'
And so when the little girls hear that, so see, e, daddy looks so strange. I'm not any strange person. The truth is that understand what you have become in him. You have become a priest and a king. And you know what is what is meant to be a king? Where is Andrew? Anybody who doesn't buy the book, force him to buy it by force. Where is he? Read it. Obi, I want to book the book. So you, we are encouraging everybody to buy a copy of Apostle's book. Huh. Everything that Apostle can do, you can also do because it. Because of what you have become in him. Son in your Baba, you are if you go, if you like, go and arrest the devil and say, hey, hey, and see what will happen. That is how the statement is. So even as you sit here and sit here, you are very powerful because you are in him. In this our church, it is the elderly woman who drives away the devil. You will not see a member of this church that the, 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 the son will be sick, then the wife or the mother will be running looking for the husband. No, <laughs> by the time the husband will come, the mother has prayed for the son and a, the son as well. And Jesus asked whether when the son of man comes, he will come and find faith in this generation. Because, because we don't understand. Look into my eyes. Shamanim. Look into my eyes. Shamanim. Can I tell you something? You are very powerful. You are powerful in him. And tomorrow I will show you how. Show you how. That in you that the demons and principalities may know the wisdom of God. I've already prayed for two hours. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord cause you to do exploits. May your end Entire life and destiny be changed. In Jesus' name. Yes, These saints want to shout and say, Amen. Amen. Rise up on your feet. Come closer to me quickly. If you still want it. Come closer to me quickly. If you still want it. Come closer to me quickly. If you still want it. And pastor has given us only 15 minutes to now, do this. So far, my 15 minutes, Pastor Fanye. Let all your self, low self-esteem go. Ma, wo no se di ohun ohun awon ma so ne mi mi ni mi mi ni me no nyina ma enko from Zabre. Let your low self-esteem go. Oh, ma, bu a bu hu abonfia no enko. Your low self-esteem. Sometimes you look at yourself and say, Oh, me. But you see, I've seen it again. There is a baby in this house. Amen. Amen. It will take the believing to take it. Mm. If I were here, and I'm looking for a baby, I will buy my baby's coat tomorrow. Oh, Amen. Amen. It's a free taste, you know. When you own your mash.
And we have only 10 minutes. When now you, you, go, to pay, go, you go and continue. But whatever you have faith to take, I'm going to lead you to pray a simple faith prayer. After you have prayed the prayer and said amen, amen. Just be quiet in his presence. And start breathing in him. And your mind will be saying that I am in you. If it is sickness, it will leave. If it is a struggle, it will suddenly go away. He himself will be where you are standing. See, destinies will be drawn. Destinies will be drawn. Oh, Something that is as if it's waiting will all of a sudden come. It will be like God has actually okay. met you. Right there where you are standing. Right there where you are standing. Right where you are standing. Lift up your two hands. I can hear him right now. I can feel him right now. I can feel him. He's standing right there where you are standing. He's right there. Tonight is a night of miracle. His hand shall touch you. His shall come upon you. You will be changed. You will be changed. You will be changed. Lift up your hands. No singing, no blowing in tongues, nothing. Just the prayer of faith. After you have said amen, stand in his presence and breathe in him. That your spirit says, I am in you. Lift it up and say this after me Father in, Father in heaven, I thank you. I thank you. I thank you that you have forgiven me. That you have forgiven me all my sins. All my sins. 
and you have accepted me and you have accepted me into yourself into yourself i belong to you i belong to you i'm your property i am your property you have a seal you have a seal and a mark and a mark upon my life upon my life that i am yours that i am yours i thank you i thank you thank you for giving me thank you for giving me just as i just as i have forgiven have forgiven every other person every older person who has erred against me who has erred against me in my life in my life i lift up your my hands to you i lift up my hands to you and confess and confess that my body that my body is the temple of the holy spirit is the temple of the holy spirit that the instruments of my body that the instruments of my body are instruments of righteousness are instruments of righteousness yielded to god yielded to god and his service and his service satan has no part in me satan has no part in me Satan has no power over me. Satan has no power over me. He has no claims against me. He has no claims against me. Because I have been washed. Because I have been washed. And Ephesians 1 7 says. And Ephesians 1 7 says. In him. In him. Through his blood. Through his blood. I have forgiveness of sins. I have forgiveness of sins. Every sin I ever committed. Every sin I ever committed. I have been forgiven. I have been forgiven. And it says. And it says. In him. In him. Through his blood. Through his blood. I have redemption. I have redemption. Romans chapter 5 verse 9 says. Romans chapter 5 verse 9 says. In his blood. In his blood. I have been justified. I have been justified. Made righteous and whole. Made righteous and whole. Just as if. Just as if I've never heard before. I have never heard before. In Hebrews chapter 13. In Hebrews chapter 13. The Bible says. The Bible says. Through his blood. Through his blood. And in him. And, and in him. I have been sanctified. I have been sanctified. Washed. Washed. Cleansed. Cleansed. Set apart. Set apart. By faith. By faith. The Bible says. The Bible says. In him. In him, I have been sealed. I have been sealed by the Holy Spirit. By the Holy Spirit, Father, Father, as I reach out my hands, as I lift up my hands, every power, every power of darkness, of darkness, overshadowing me, overshadowing me due to lack of knowledge, due to lack of knowledge, right now, right now. Power of curse. Power of curse. Demonic holdings. Demonic holdings. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I command them. I command them to live my life. To live my life. Every power. Every power that keeps following me. That keeps following me. It's in the wrong place. To the wrong wrong place. place. Because I am in Him. Because I am in him. I command that power. I command that power. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Live. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Live. Live. Sickness. Sickness. Live. Live. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Barrenness, live, live in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, full impersonation, impersonation, live, live in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, every kind of dainty, every kind of dainty, you have no place, you have no place, have no power, you have no power over me, over me. I am whole. I am whole. I am blessed. I am blessed. I am sanctified. I am sanctified. I am washed. I am washed. I am delivered. I am delivered. In the blood of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. The blessing of Abraham. The blessing of Abraham. Are mine. Amen. 
Thank you, Jesus. 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 One last more. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let your hands go and just be quiet. Breathe in him. Now in him. Wonimu. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This is wholeness. Thank you. Thank you. His finger is changing you. His power is overwhelming you. He took me. My And you are encountering him tonight. See. See. He's standing in front of you. Reach out and touch him. Thank you. Reach out and touch him. Thank you. Reach out and touch him. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Reach out and touch him. It is so tangible. When his finger touches you, you see it. What an amazing grace. This is divine. Something ancient is leaving. It's leaving. It's leaving. It's leaving. Something ancient is leaving. Mama Sorabaha. Something ancient is leaving. I can see. It's ancient. And sometimes we call him the ancient of days. It's ancient. It's leaving. And as you leave, don't come back again. This is ancient. See? It's living. 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 Maya Kasanaba is standing right where you are. It's living. And you cannot visit any man. You cannot visit any man and claim yourself a conqueror. Live. 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 Maya Saba. And when the doctor had no remedy, his blood is able. Don't look at anybody. Just reach out and touch him. In him. In him. Rabba Sayaha. Rabba Baba Baba Shanta Baba Bai. I curse you to your root. This should be the last time you will ever be here. Go. Go. In him is the fullness of God. <sighs> Live! He's been paid for. And the price is settled. The blood of atonement. <laughs>